The Inland Northwest Blood Center needs more donors. The organization says blood banks across the country are struggling to keep up with demand. KXY Force Grace Ditzler is working for you to explain why there's a shortage in Grace. The FDA is asking some communities to stop blood collection. Right, Aaron, the blood bank is calling the situation a perfect storm. Normally, the summer is their slow season anyway, but the threat of the Zika virus is causing issues for blood banks around the country. Health officials are investigating four cases of the Zika virus in Florida. The new fear? Zika transmitting mosquitoes could now be in the U.S. The FDA is asking blood centers in parts of Florida to temporarily stop collecting from blood donors. And that's having a trickle-down effect on Spokane's blood supply. So it's been a building of a perfect storm. Those Florida communities will still need blood, even though their blood donation centers are closed. That whole region is now going to need to be shipped in blood. That's a concern. During the summer, the Inland Northwest Blood Center says it loses a big chunk of its donor base because students are out for the summer. Added to that, people are being asked not to donate blood within 28 days of traveling to countries with Zika mosquitoes. We have a lot of folks that have been traveling, so they're self-deferring as we've asked them to. They're not coming down to donate. Well, this is happening widespread across the country. Blood centers around the country usually send blood back and forth to ensure all the centers have an adequate supply of each type. We import sometimes and we you know, we'll send blood too if we have a sister um, organization that needs it. So we share to make sure everybody's safe. But the blood center says because of the strain on the national supply, that isn't happening right now. So we are really on our own. We have to be self-sustaining. So we're meeting daily demand, but emergency supplies are not what they need to be. Jennifer explains that's why they're urging healthy donors to step in to help fill that supply. And the Blood Center encourages anyone who can to come donate. The center is especially in need of negative blood types, especially O negative. The main center on Cataldo in downtown Spokane is open seven days a week. Reporting live on the Skydeck tonight, Grace Ditzler, KXLY 4 News.